Okay, this is Jeff at Quadricopter, and today we're talking about the, um, the MZ24 and the GR24L. This is now coming with version 3.78, so in order to enable failsafe, we have to do a couple different things within the radio. So right now, this is how it comes out of the box, default. What happens is if I turn off the transmitter, I should see a no receiver error in my MK tools, and I should also get a beep that indicates that I have no receiver strength. Um, however, it's not activating that, so in order to correct that, we'll turn the transmitter back on. Okay, so the first thing, let's hit this little button that says F, function. Go into telemetry, go to setting and data view, and you're going to get a screen that looks like this. The first line you can see, this is your version of your receiver, um, version 3.78. That's the version of this GR24L. So to change the failsafe to activate, let's go hit this enter button once. We're gonna go to another screen, hit that enter button one more time. That goes to this screen. What we wanna do is change this mode. So what I'm gonna do is hit this um, increment button. So we're gonna drop down into the mode. I'm going to hit set. This is going to turn red, and I'm just going to turn that so it says off. Hit set again. Everything's back to yellow. Let's just go back to our main screen. So now what's going to happen is as I turn off our transmitter, we get that beep on the copter saying we have no receiver strength. And also on our MK tools, we have receive, um, RC signal lost. Once again, if we turn on the transmitter, we should get receiver strength back. So once again, the, res uh, the beeping stops, we have receiver strength, and also that error goes away. Um, so once again, this is for the, the, um, the GR24Ls, and we are seeing it on the, the 3.78 version. Also, there's a 3.76, we still have to go back and verify, we don't have any of the old ones, so I'm not too sure if you have to do that. But if you're in doubt, just put your copter on the bench, take the props off, turn everything on, turn off your transmitter. If you don't get that RC signal loss or the beeping error, um, yeah, dive in this thing and make sure that you can activate failsafe. Anyway, this has been Jeff from Quadricopter, and we'll talk to you soon. Uh, sure.